I smell lies and deceit on Instagram. With the filter and without. Oh yeah, it like reshapes my whole face. Thoughts of my new lips? What did they inject as it say? <laughs> so since my last recreating TikTok video where I recreated this TikTok with this ridiculous catfish filter. <laughs> oh, and here it is again, ooh. Ever since finding out that this existed, to the point where people were using it and I had no idea that they were using a filter, I wondered how many more filters are there out there that look pretty legit? Like, make you look like a totally different person, aka help you catfish the bejesus out of somebody. So there's gonna be two parts to this video. The first, we're gonna hunt down the most catfish-esque filters we can find and take some pictures. And then part two, I'm gonna be sending those pictures to my friends and family to see if they can tell whether A, it's not actually me, if it looks enough not like me that I can pull it off, or B, can tell that it's a filter and not what I actually look like at that moment. Sadly, because I just used this for a video and TikTok, I feel like I can't use this one. People will know. Okay, notice anything a uh, bit different about me? I can't tell if I like or hate this. <laughs> like, I don't know if I'm supposed to look like Kylie Jenner. Is that what I'm supposed to look like? I look like a woman child. Like, I don't know how else. I know it did something to my lips and my teeth. Cleared my skin. I have no dark circles, thank you, filter. But like, it definitely looks like I had some sort of work done to my face. So I kind of want to get a really good picture and then try to trick some of my YouTube friends that I haven't seen in person in a little while into thinking maybe I had some plastic surgery work done. <laughs> okay, how am I gonna be? I have to make this look legit. <laughs> I don't know what this was. Legit, this is what I need to look. Oh my God, it makes my top teeth look so big. Okay, so I'm supposed to look like, was that good? It doesn't look different enough. Ugh, when you smile, it makes you look terrible. So I have to do the pouty face, okay? Okay, yeah, that might work. I look like I have resting bitch face with this filter. That's what this looks like. Just to give us a contrast with the filter and without. Oh yeah, it like reshapes my whole face. What is this? Oh my God, it makes my chin and everything just like brings it up. Oh my God, that might be perfect. <laughs> that photo. <laughs> oh my God. I mean, I wish I had a bigger upper lip, but not like that. This legit makes me look like a child. <laughs> and then immediately I'm like, I don't know. I'm taking off years of my life. But it's all a lie. It's all fake. There we go. Just a couple for good measure, you know. If nobody thinks I got work done, I'm going to be so flattered. <laughs> I hate the in-between. I swear this makes me look worse than anything else. Like the non-filter Instagram story. Why? I see everything. When I look in a mirror, it doesn't look this bad. <laughs> well, as most of you know, I always sport this like cat eye liquid eyeliner on the top lid. I've been obsessed with it since college and it's kind of stuck for everyday makeup. But if I ever don't feel like doing my everyday makeup, I could just go here. I mean, I might just use this. You guys will never know. <laughs> There we go, just a simple photo. I'll save it, but I'm not gonna send it to anybody because it's not really a catfish. That's basically what I look like, except more smooth skin, fake blush, and fake eyeliner. But if you've ever wondered what I'd look like with a bunch of freckles on my face, now you know. Look, there's even different amounts we could do. Whoa, all over. Whoa, so many. Oh, <gasps> purple ones? Oh my God. What? Looks like I have paint splatter on my face or I killed a unicorn. I don't know. <laughs> Either or. Ooh, blue. Murdering Smurfs. I'm gonna take one with this. Oh, cute. Okay, Bobby and I tried this the other day. This one definitely looks way more fake, but look at them lashes, girl. Okay, this is just smooth skin. Ooh, this will come in handy. The heck is this? I have to change. Whoa, my eyes. I never have to do makeup again. <gasps> Life changing. Ugh. Okay, so here's my regular. Oh, oh, she fierce. It makes my eyes look different, but let's see if we can get a, a photo where this looks kind of real. Darn it, it's not lining up with my eye properly. Nope, that screwed it up. I was like, maybe if I look to the side, it'll work. All right, close enough. Oh, these are just ones that turn me into creatures, not other people. You know, like a bird person. Give me all your seeds. Bird Lauren wants all your seeds. I smell bread. 
I smell lies and deceit on Instagram. This is the troll, you know, that gets you when you try to pretend like you're actually the filter instead of your own self. All right, that's basically what I could find that looked legit on Instagram at least, but now I'm over to Snapchat and I found a bunch more. Oh my God, they have an icy catfish eye too. Oh, it's like the same one, except it's a little creepier. I don't know why, it just is. And I look like I have severe sunburn. Oh my God, can I be James Charles? <gasps> Oh my God, I'm James Charles. Hi sisters. This is so creepy. Oh my God, I can make him have all different emotions. Happy or cre creepy, happy, sad, angry. Oh my God, are those my teeth? Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Right, guys, I'm the new James Charles now. Mm, yes, I never blink though. I never blink. Okay, so this filter gives you purple hair and uh, uh yeah. Oh, I was like, oh, I can make somebody think I'm upset and crying, but this doesn't look real. Maybe if I put the right face with it, it'll look real. Perfect. <laughs> That's not gonna work, but we'll see. Ooh, this one's black hair. You can still kind of see the purple though. Yes, okay. I wanted to see, there's one that's supposed to be able to give you bangs. Okay, no, that really Snapchat. Oh my God. <laughs> this looks so scary. Here. I found one that's supposed to make my lips look like brat doll lips. Oh yeah, it looks like I got tons of work done. I look like a totally different person and not in a good way. <laughs> Actually, it looks like I got stung by a bee. In this photo, it looks like I got work done, but you can't tell what. Like you're like, she doesn't look right. <laughs> Trying to make my lips look as big as possible. There we go. Like Bobby would it would know that I didn't get work done, but I wonder if I sent this to him and said I tried that like Kylie Jenner lip sucking trend that was terrible. I wonder if he would believe me. I'd be like, my lips are swollen. <laughs> Help. <laughs> they look swollen. <laughs> Perfect. I mean, then there's like simple ones that look like I'm wearing glasses. Are there any nose nose job filters? Oh God, what did I just do? What did I just do? Plastic surgery. Sounds great. This is plastic surgery? How different is, is it? Ugh. Whoa, I don't like this. They like elongated my face. You know what? I think we have enough to send around. Actually though, I think I'm gonna take one without the fake eyes of the one filter that started it all. I can pretend I just got super glammed up. Professional makeup artist. <laughs> I mean, I was James Charles for about five seconds today. Ooh, there's one that has lipstick. Oh, and it makes my lips look different. Okay, we'll use this one. Cause this is not at all how I would ever do my makeup by myself. Cool, perfect. All right, time to catfish some of my friends and family into thinking that I had plastic surgery work done pretty much. <laughs> okay, so it's the next day and these responses could not have been better. Like a decent amount of people legitimately thought that I had gotten plastic surgery done to my face because of these filters. That's how legit they looked. All right, so I was already talking to Scott about something else. So he was my first victim. So I said, by the way, I got temporary lip injections, but I'm kind of self-conscious about it thoughts and sweet boy that he is was like let's see a pic i'm sure you look amazing as per usual oh i have such great friends so i sent this one with like the weird kylie jenner lips and he said honestly they look great you look amazing like usual i wonder what life's like when you're pretty i swear to god i did not tell them that i was filming a video <laughs> like he thought this looks good I mean, I guess it doesn't look bad, but it definitely looks like I had something done to my face. So I said, oh, thanks, boo. Well, day one, they looked like that, but I asked for a bit more and now they look like dot, dot, dot. <laughs> the other terrible filter. It looks so bad. <laughs> I kept trying to like hint that this was actually a filter and not real, but no, he didn't get it. Honestly, you look good no matter what. And there's no point in getting self-conscious about it cause it's done. I mean, I guess that's good advice. Like, oh, it's, well, it's too late now, don't be self-conscious. As long as you're happy with it, then F everyone else. And it was at that moment I realized, no, he thinks I'm being serious. The photos look legit. Scott, thank you for saying I look good, but this photo, I look horrible. He's just like, he's probably like, oh girl, oh, I'm, I gotta help her self-esteem. So then I sent the crying filter, which is definitely 100% percent fake looking with the fake tears. I said, oh my God, you're so sweet, I'm crying. And then he said, wait, is this like a 
video of I use filters to see what my friend thinks. And then I, I used this gift because it was too perfect. But yay, he finally got it. It only took three filtered photos. But oh, what a sweet friend. What a sweet supportive friend. Thanks, Scott. So then I moved on to my girl Yammy and said, so I did that Kylie Jenner lip suction trend thing and it went way wrong. I said, wait, what? Oh my God, why? And then I sent this horrible looking photo. And then she said, haven't you seen the videos of people with busted up lips? Oh, nice editing. I see through your lies. She, damn it. I knew it. I knew it was too risky to use that other photo, but I had to because it was just too good. Nice try, Lauren, but I see what you're doing. Are you filming a video? She's too smart for me. So I kept trying. I said, no, I wish I'm deformed, Yammy, with the crying filter. And then she responded, it's okay, Lauren, don't cry. Just get Bobby to give a big kiss to your new Kylie Jenner lips. <laughs> So then I just kept going and said, he won't kiss me anymore. He wants a divorce. My lips are too big. And then I said, okay, fine. You're too smart. Cause I, I knew, I knew. And then she replied, you can't trick me, Lauren. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> She's too smart. All right, we're one failed, but one success so far. So then I hit up my friend Cassie, AKA Gloom on YouTube. Because I know, I know she would be honest and tell me if I looked bad or if she could just see through my lies immediately. So I said, so I got some work done to my face recently, but I'm kind of self-conscious about it. Thoughts. And I sent the photo that makes me look like I had legit plastic surgery. And she responded, oh, what did you do? Which is, which is smart. She's not saying she hate, I mean, it kind of sounds like she hates it. It's good. She should hate it. I look really bad in this. So then I sent this makeup one and said, I mean, with makeup on, I think it doesn't look that bad, right? To see if she would think that was legit makeup. But no, she said, yeah, it looks all right with the filter on and I said, damn it, you're too smart. And she wrote, dude, you scared me so bad. I was like, what have you done? But didn't want to be rude. See, I told you, she would tell me the truth. And then she said, I was 100% gonna Google if you can dissolve cheekbone filler and suggest it. I said, true friend. I mean, seriously. Look at the cheekbones and the, like, no, this is not a good look for me. So after messing with my friends, I decided to turn it onto my family, who I thought would be harder to trick, but I was wrong. Except for Bobby, he can always see through my lies. So I decided to go the freckle angle because I knew he would know that I didn't get lip injections. So I said, hey baby, so I got these new tattoo freckles put on. Aren't they cute? And he was like, tattoos, really? Like, as in they last forever? Yeah, it's like the new in thing now makes you look younger. They're cute, right? And he said, I mean, they're cute, but why? Why, <laughs> why so many? I mean, yeah, there's a lot. I, I, there's a lot on there. And then he goes, they look weird, like fake. Oh, it's a filter? I said, I mean, technically they're fake because they would, they're tattoo freckles, which are fake. I said, no, they're real fake freckles. <laughs> it's a filter, stop, stop. Stop pranking me. And then I sent the crying face and said, also you left the toilet seat up this morning and I fell in. And he said, good. And that's, that's been the end of our conversation. Next was my sister. And I sent the Kylie Jenner lip one again and said, thoughts of my new lips? And she said, um, did you do the crazy suction thing? Nah, they're temporary lip fillers. Bee venom? Question mark. Oh no, you hate them. No, they're voluptuous, but your lips were great before. What did they inject? Is it safe? I like how she's just the concerned sister, like not that I changed my face, but she wants to make sure I'm safe. <laughs> so then I decided to mess with that aspect and said, I'm not sure if it's safe because this morning I woke up looking more like this and then sent the ridiculous looking one. Oh my God, did you show mom what the heck bean, which is my family nickname. I'm not judging, but did you research? So at this point, I feel bad because it's been going, it was going on for too long. So I was trying to make up ridiculous lies. So she would be like, wait a minute. No. So I said, nah, this guy Randy that we know from the gym said he'd give us a good deal and I trusted him. I, I'm sure it will be okay. I feel like you should ask mom, wait, are you punking me for your channel? And then I sent this gif. <laughs> And lastly was my mom, bless her. I kept debating if I wanted to do this to her because I know it would give her a heart attack, but I felt like I had to. So I sent the Kylie Jenner photo and said, thoughts on my new lips? She said, hmm, not sure, what did you do? So I think she thinks I look like this. <laughs> this is just me. She couldn't put her finger on what I did to my lips. And I said, lip fillers. 
Really? Why? You had nice lips. You are beautiful without all of that stuff. Aw, such a mom answer. Aw, thanks, mom. And then I sent this filter because I, I felt too bad. I didn't want to carry it out. I felt so bad. I was like, I'll just send another filter so she kind of gets it. So I sent the freckle one and said, I also got freckle tattoos. Then she said, is this just one of those pics, Ella, I was hoping? And then, yeah, I came clean. I couldn't mess with her for too long because I knew she would bug out. So I think it was kind of tied, right? I definitely got Scott. I definitely got my sister. I like half got Cassie and half got my mom. Did not get Yammy and did not really get Bobby. So yeah, I I'll take it. It worked on like half the people. So lesson for today, don't believe anything you ever see on Instagram ever or any photo that your friend texts you. Okay, bye.